be with you in one second. Actually, um, what is that? Let me just do that. Ooh. Let's see if I'm in the frame. Yeah. Hi, guys. How you doing? I went for a lovely walk this morning. It was so amazing. After dropping my son at school. Um, that's what I do every morning, basically. With the light on in the back just to try and be creative i don't know how does it look i wonder if it's gonna bother me is this bothering you should i put it off hmm. let's see also i tried a new hairstyle i'm just trying to be creative today you know just i don't know i guess i'm feeling creative today trying out new things what do you think I remember when I was in high school and stuff, I used to make lots of cute hairstyles and yeah, I guess when you get older, that's not so important, I guess, yeah. Um, so I started going to group therapy recently um, because um, I'm broken. <laughs> No, I've got some I've got some stuff going on with me. Um, some trauma that happened and it disrupts my life basically and I had to give up so many things because of it. Um, like for instance, um, the hardest thing I had to give up was being an actress. <sighs> Even though I've tried so many times to just you know to just get into that space again as soon as I try I just completely uh, struggle um, with my hormones emotionally I, I, I stress out so much um, that my whole body just you know I start panicking and my depression and anxiety just goes all crazy and you know I'm a mom I'm not alone I have my son to take care of and stuff and he's my first priority actually so anyway um so i'm going to therapy i have group therapy because i have pmdd and all the other stuff and whatever and apparently i might have ptsd as well but complex ptsd which which is brought on from like childhood trauma and stuff because i have a lot of flashbacks of stuff that maybe happened or stuff that I did to someone is feeling guilty, you know, so just being in that moment of feeling the exact same way I felt when the thing was happening, you know, when I felt maybe threatened or whatever. Um, so that is something that uh, me and my doctors are going to be looking into as well. It's just good to understand. Um, it's just good to understand why you are the way you are you know why i struggle with certain things and stuff so that i can know when i'm feeling a certain way that oh okay it's that so i know what to do to make myself feel better basically um so the group therapy which is the main topic let's not go off a topic um the group therapy has been actually very nice at the beginning um when my therapist suggested it um, I was a bit nervous about it because I have social anxiety and for me being in a room full of people and being around people that you know could trigger me and just make me just ah um, but then I thought let's give it a go you know um, obviously um, the doctors and the psychologists and whatever they know what they're doing and they chose like a certain number of people to be in this group people have like similar kind of stuff so um yeah once i started going i think i've been to three now um once i started going it's actually amazing to be around people who who's kind of going through the same thing you're going through you know so 
um some of them are obviously worse and some of them are like on your level and just it's different but it's kind of like uh it's we kind of have the same thing you know where we all struggle with certain um the mental things and emotional and hormones and whatever and stuff which makes us not able to function properly uh, every day and stuff um so it is so it is it feels so good to be around people who understand what you're talking about like when i say certain things that i go through in the group in the group therapy people are nodding they're going yeah yes mm. but uh, when i say to my friends and normal people they what you know what i'm going through they always like oh my goodness what's wrong with this chick oh oh no i should stop being friends with her they don't say it but you know i can see that in their face and then i always end up feeling terrible and i guess that's why i always self isolate and stuff um but just being here you know and hearing everyone's stories and what they're going through and it kind of distracts you from whatever is going up in here you know and in your life and stuff so if you are considering going to group therapy and you are feeling a little bit scared i would say um give it a try give it a go um if you can of course we all different um i i'm at a stage right now where i'm just basically willing to try anything that could work so that i can say okay i've tried that um because i know that i need to be i need to feel good and be healthy you know and also to be a good mom and stuff like that because i've decided to give my son the most amazing and bestest childhood i possibly can he's my prince he's just my cute little prince and stuff um so and everyone there is lovely you know they are just lovely everyone has their own personalities there's two people who are like the funny ones and stuff and then there's one guy he's kind of like our leader you know he's got like all these cool stories and stuff and he knows a lot um about just you know he knows a lot about life and the system and people and he talks a lot about the government and stuff like that and i really i really admire him for being so open and honest about you know where he comes from and what he struggles with and stuff like that um and then we have the shy girl and we have the pretty girl um and then we have one that's kind of the you know the not the leader but the the elder one that um we also kind of well for me i look up to and stuff like that and then there's two therapists in the room so we just all like you know discussing and going through um life and what works and what we can do and stuff like last week was pros and cons of self isolation and we all agreed that self isolating is heaven <laughs> basically um because that's the first thing we want to do you know all of us is just self isolate just get away from people we like you know vampires get away from the sun and stuff so um yeah i go once a week it's lovely i absolutely look forward to it um it feels good knowing that um i'm going to a group where i am accepted where i'm not um feeling judged or made to feel like there's something completely wrong with me i already know there's something wrong with me but there you just feel like <sighs> you belong and isn't that what we all want we just want to feel like we belong right yes so yeah that's my little experience that i'm going through right now with a the group therapy And if you are starting group therapy, I wish you good luck with it and stuff and give it a go if you want to. Um I'm having fun. I feel I feel I feel good. And also I don't socialize a lot, so the, the, that's like my little my little weekly socializing, so I don't feel guilty, you know. Um then after that I buy myself chocolate. Well, I always buy chocolate and I need to give chocolate up also. So, yeah. Okay. I'll speak to you guys later. Bye.